Hi everyone! Uh, my name is Ivy and I'm going to show you today a packing video on the Bee Supplied. It's a pump bag and this is in the Whimsical Whisper print that is releasing this month. In fact, it'll be releasing January 24th at midnight uh, Eastern Standard Time for the people like me on the Pacific uh, Coast. That means um, 9 p.m. for Pacific Standard Time. So let me go ahead and get started. This is Whimsical Whisper. This is part of the Rose Gold line, Rose Gold collection. And this is something that is a pump bag. Now, although I don't have kids where I need to pump or breastfeed anymore, I'm going to show you how to use this bag as an everyday or all day bag uh, instead. My kids are actually older and <laughs> well out of nursing age, so uh, let me go ahead and get started. So here we have the mommy pocket. It has two side pockets, one over here, and then which is actually the pump compartment. And then we also have another side pocket. They're both quite large, and I will show you in a moment. And. There is also a slip pocket uh, for you to use as well. It does not come with a changing pad. Like I said, this is uh, actually a pump bag, not a diaper bag. So if you needed to use a change pad, you can get a separate one and fold it up and slip it in this slip pocket or one of the other pockets or pouches that you may need to use. So let me turn this back around. The pump bag comes with the messenger strap here. It is detachable, so you can also adjust it and wear over one shoulder or crossbody as needed. The shoulder pad here is uh, it's movable, so it will allow freedom of movement when you turn or when you pick up your kids or whatever it is that you may be doing during the day. Um, and so I'm going to show you the front here in the mommy pocket. What I have here in the mommy pocket is I have reusable grocery bags. These are uh, nylon bags that I have folded up. They're really squishy so they fit nicely in here. Uh, there's also a mesh pocket which I have containing the sunglass or you can have sunglasses here but I have my prescription um, eyeglasses here with a slim case so it's it's not big like the B Shady and I'll show you this is the B Shady compared to see this is much thicker so I have this in this pocket hand cream sanitizer spray and a matching rose gold pen you know who you are I got it as a gift thank you very much so let me go ahead and, and zip that up. You can also attach your keys in here. If the eyeglass case wasn't here, you could attach it and have room in there. Uh, because I have the eyeglass, eyeglass case here, it will be bulky. Um, I did try it. I didn't like it because it added too much bulk. So I'm going to zip that back up. Again, it's very spacious, which I like. If you saw my other video, um, you would have seen that I actually was able to fit a mini helix in here. So now I'm going to show you this pocket and this is the pump compartment which has gussets for you so it doesn't open all the way but it has it allows a nice wide opening um, over here. So what I have placed in here it fits a small set piece. This happens to be a Toki uh, far, far fall uh, print and this is a custom piece but it's a same size as a small set piece. In here there's plenty of room to fit two mini helixes. Yes, two mini helixes. They're fully packed and if I didn't have them packed I would actually be able to fit three empty ones. And just to show you, this 
these are the two mini helixes fully packed you can see they're not just empty I'm trying to squish it for you they're fully so one I am using as a wallet the other one I am using as a um, snack bag so it's completely stuffed with snacks the other one has a small set piece with card holder and cash zip that up I'm going to turn it the other way so that way we can see the other pocket again same size pocket however it is not for a pump but you can use it for other things it has two mesh pockets here in this pocket I have the mini wipe pouch this actually does not have wipes in it believe it or not I am uh, I have a sports cooling towel or a cooling towel in here and the reason why I have that is because if you have a little one or you feel warm for whatever reason you might be coming down with something or maybe you just had a really active day and need to cool down quickly you can take this dry towel wet it with some water snap it and then apply it to around your neck wear it like a little scarf or you know just put it on top of your head so that way you cool down quickly especially if you have little ones who cannot take uh, medicine or um, because they're too young or maybe they just took it and you're just you just need all the help you can get to help them cool down and you can always place it back inside wet when you're done because it's a it's a white pouch so it's designed to hold wet things and not leak so but if you ever have any issues you can always contact the manufacturer and she's really good about um, you know taking care of you know any defects so anyway I also have in here a power bank and nose wipes uh, a lot of people know this nose wipe saline nose wipe whatever you might want to use that's fine it fits in here this happens to be a travel pack of it And now I'm going to show you the inside. First, I'm going to show you the top. The zipper goes along from here to here. And I'm going to go ahead and open that for you and show you what's inside. And the reason why I mentioned the way, if you notice how I'm sliding it open, it's designed like the Be Prepared. The Be Prepared, I'm sorry. So um, you can open this up nicely. It'll have a nice big opening. And if you've ever seen one, you have one. You know what I'm talking about. It's not just a straight zipper across. It kind of curves with the shape of the bag. So continuing with the inside, this area here you see is actually where the uh, pump compartment is. So you see it takes up the space from here to here. And so actually it's still kind of squishy so I could put more stuff in the pump compartment on top of the mini helixes if I wanted to or place it on top of what I already have packed in here and what I have packed in here is the butterfly force this is a be quick I'm using this as a first aid kit it also contains Two small set pieces which is also part of the January release as you can see it goes very nicely with it this is the olive and lum uh, luminaire ever and put this down I'll show you a better picture of it here or a better shot of it here this is the Olive Ever set piece, medium set piece. If you purchase the B set, it comes in three sizes, it comes with three pouches. And this is the medium. I also have a large set piece in here. This is the Luminaire. As you can see, it's like a pewter, but the hardware is silver. So here's the large set piece. I happen to have a Techni scarf in here. You can put swaddle blanket or nursing scarf, whatever it is, 
maybe an extra change of clothes for your kid. That's fine. This is the Olive Ever with the black hardware. And you see how that kind of shimmers with the metallic, and then this is not metallic. The Olive is not metallic. So I use this for my makeup bag. And also what fits in here is a 17 ounce water bottle. Uh, this actually is a rose gold swell bottle and it fits perfectly inside. I do like that brand because it actually keeps my drinks cold and um, my cold drinks cold and my hot drinks hot. So, but I mainly use it for cold drinks. Uh, but you can use like for hot tea, hot water to mix formula. So if you're going somewhere and you don't have hot water, uh, you're not you don't have access to hot water, you could always carry it with you and then add it to your bottle and just shake it up so that way your little one has something to drink when it's feeding time. And so let me pack this back up. Fits nicely. I'm not even forcing it. There's room for everything. And so you can see how it fits. There's literally, there's more space on top. I was actually able to fit another set piece on top before, if you saw my previous video on the bee supply. So what I'm also going to show you is, notice the lining. I know it's going to come up. It's very much like the Legacy lining. So, because, you can see here. And this legacy piece is the Night Stars, which is very nice. And the legacy line has the gold hardware, just so you know. I also like this print too, but this is um, got looks like the same lining. So let me flip this back up. What I'm going to do also, because you may or may not carry a wallet, so I'm going to take these out. show you that I have their large wallet and see if that fits in this mommy pocket. So, and as a matter of fact, with a little bit of working it, I can actually fit that in there. So, it'll fit lying down that way. And it looks like it, if I can zip it up, I may be able to close this. So it'll fit standing as well. A little bit snug. So just so you know. And that wallet's empty. I don't have anything in there. But I know people will ask what wallet's going to fit. So if you don't carry too much, this is the B Spendy. Um, and the B Rich is about the same size. So I would say that it, they will both fit if you do carry something like this. If not, that's okay. I wanted to show you the other print, the other floral print that I have. Oh, sorry. It's on this side. The other floral print that's also coming out for this January release is the Sakura. This is a recolor of the Sakura Swirl, and I have that here to compare. And this is the original Sakura Swirl. Okay, mm, what's the best way to show? There we go. So, it has a white background with the pink flowers and lavender gray leaves, and this one is more of a lavender with green leaves and pops of pink and a kind of yellow, orange, peachy flower to it. It's really pretty. Personally, I prefer this one, but I know some of you like the original one, which is fine too. Something for everyone. And just to show what is in the mini helix that you can pack, here's a small set piece that fits
what's inside. Card holder and cash in there. Additional card holder. Holds about 12 or 13 cards right now. Um, for extra cards, whatever they may be, for like game zones or membership cards or gift cards, insurance cards, you get the picture. There is a zipper here for this front slip pocket and that can actually fit a B charge. And this one has the Lego play passes for the family. And this print is the Iconic 2 by Tokidoki. And what can fit in the small zipper pocket in the front is this coin purse. So B charge will not fit in here, which is why I am showing it with a coin purse instead with the in the um, Sakura swirl. And so that fits nicely in there. Uh, for this, you can put coins in there, obviously coins and cash, but right now I have extra pair of contacts, visine drops, as well as contact drops. So if you are like me and wear contacts or just need a lot of eye care with you, um, this will fit and it fits perfectly here. All you have to do is put on the strap and wear it over the shoulder, crossbody, or even you can wear it as a hip bag, hip pouch. Or some of you might know and remember the fanny pack. Wear it that way, around your waist. So I'm going to put that back in here. Again, a lot of space. In my other video, I did show that there you could actually fit glass containers in here. Uh, three glass containers made by Pyrex for capacity. So um, it's very spacious. So whatever pump that you have, whatever uh, purpose you're using this for, it's not just for a pump. Again, I don't pump. I'm not even nursing. My kids are nowhere near the age of nursing anymore. They're all in, you know, they're all school age kids. So, and I have two boys. And so I am packing this for you. So that way, if you like to use this for beyond the baby years, or maybe you're in between babies, you can still use it and love it. There's no reason not to. It's another bag, yes, but repurpose it because, you know, this has uh, many uses for it. You could use it as your car bag. You could use it as your all-day bag. Maybe you're going to the park all day or going to your in-laws or having dinner or whatnot, baby party, birthday party. You can pack everything that you need in here. Um, so. There's no reason to give it up. If you love it, wear it. And I hope that today's packing helped you find, figure out what you like out of this collection and whether this bag works for you. I also had a request that I wanted to show size-wise what this compares to. So I have with me a B Classy. So this is the B Classy, and you can see it looks bigger, wider. It looks wider. So size-wise, it's longer side by side. From top to bottom, it looks very close in size. And side by side, let's take a look. So I, I can say that you're going to need different packing just because of the pump compartment. So please keep that in mind. I also have the B Sporty that was also requested as far as a comparison. I feel like the B Supply packs more than the Beast Sporty, to be honest. Um, something else, they're different because this Beast Sporty is an actual backpack with seatbelt straps. The Beast Supply does not come with backpack straps, um, so you would not be able to wear it in that fashion. 
like I said, different packing. It's much, much different. If you do try to be sporty, I recommend vertical packing, meaning you put things in this way as opposed to laying them down flat. But like I said, I feel like this, I know someone has mentioned that it's kind of like a bowling ball bag, and it does look kind of like a bowling ball bag, and that's okay. Uh, it's actually quite useful even with a com uh, pump compartment and everything. So um, hopefully you have enjoyed this packing video. If you have any requests um, by comparisons or maybe other print comparisons I, that I can help you with, let me know. Leave a comment. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe for the latest updates. I'm also on Instagram. What's your poison? 888. And uh, hopefully I'll see you soon, either here or Instagram or maybe in the uh, Pink Lady community page or uh, Pink Lady chat page. Thanks again. Bye.